Good morning, good early Sunday morning, 8.30 a.m. here in the lovely state of Alabama. Hang on a second, I just, I just woke up. Mmm. Gotta have me some Starbucks in the morning. And a Starbucks mug. Oh, it sounded so girly. Yeah, a Starbucks mug. In my Starbucks mug. Okay, I hope you can see me because I'm not sure you can if I'm cutting my own head off or whatever. But, uh, okay, this so fucking pissed me off. Check this out. I have a roommate, and she never really intended to stay here. She was here because, um, of the coma and all that, and the, the fact that she knew I'd need home care, and she wasn't really attached anywhere. And so she stayed past, and she stayed past longer than she really has to, because she loves me. And you see, you'll see her on another video if you watch a message of love from my roommate Angie. Um, okay, so check this out. All we had was a blow-up air mattress. One of the really nicer ones, you know, it's a twin size, which is all she'd really need. But you don't sleep for months on something like that. And so she's been getting like this kink on her neck. So I was like, last night, or two nights ago, I was like, let's just try beds. You know, at night you can sleep in my bed because I have a nice bed and I'll sleep on the mattress. So, uh, we've been doing that and I swear to God, I don't know if it's my kidneys because they're different now from before because they had shut down or I'm, or if I'm just, I don't know what's wrong with me, but I already made one, uh, video about this and you know, I'm a real vulnerable person I put myself out there online and I tell people, I tell people everything. And I don't give a shit. Haters, beware, because you're not going to have any comments put up. I'll, I, you know, I'll just block them. But, uh, yeah, because someone did call me a sicko for the last time I talked about this. But last night, I was sleeping on the air mattress, the top of which is a velvet material. But it had blankets, so two, two comforters over it. And I was sleeping on top of two thick comforters with a light blanket, because it's it's hot in Alabama. I piss the bed. And I mean, when I piss, I don't piss just a little. I flood. And so this morning I woke up cold and wet, and I was like, son of a bitch. Bitch! Bitch! Okay, bitch. One more time, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Bitch! I had to clean that shit up, and I'm like, I think I've ruined this mattress. This air mattress is ruined. Because it's got a velvet top, so I'm asking y'all, what the fuck do you do when someone pisses on velvet? I mean, it's not that terrible. What should I use to try to clean it? Because I, I just use soap and water, just plain soap and water with a washcloth. But, and I'm hoping that'll be enough. But damn, you know, my bed, my mattress is a really nice one. The one that I've been letting her use. And I put, I've had a plastic sheet over it for for these type of things. But I'm wondering now if, I mean, how can someone sleep through that? I'm, I'm wondering if it's just my I can't wake it, you know, can't make it to morning, and because I take medication at night, I'm sleeping just right through it, or what, or if it's I'm having weird dreams, or you know, some people Isaac had said that he had a dream that he was peeing and standing up peeing and thought it was real life and he peed his bed, and I've had other people write to me, adults, and say, yeah, I pee my bed. I'm just not brave enough or stupid enough to talk about it, which is fine. But I'm thinking it's something medical now, and I see my doctor, I see one of my doctors on, looks like, oh, oh, this battery's going dead, I always say that. The 18th, that's my regular physical doctor, and a week from then, Dr. Dansby is a kitty doctor. And more than likely, he'll, I'm going to ask him and he'll know. They could probably run tests to see if it's something medical. But it really is getting old. Do I have to get adult pull-ups? Because that's what it sounds like I'm going to have to do. Because it's really... I'm sick of ruining beds and I'm sick of washing sheets and blankets all damn day. And I'm sorry for my language in this video. It's awful. Awful. But, man, I get pissed. Alrighty then. I'm going to go because I've been tagged for a game. So i got to get my thoughts together and write down the questions. It's a truth or dare game and then write down who I'm going to tag. There's certain people I want to tag that I can't tag because they don't have cameras yet, but beware you guys, the second you get them cameras you're getting tagged, so um, I'm going to go and start shooting your barbs at me. Uh, apparently you think I'll live for it, but and I'm talking to the haters anyway. 
So, talk to y'all later. Bye.